Hello and welcome to today's video break. I'm Sabra and we're in Psalm 25 verse 13 that says they will spend their days in prosperity and their descendants will inherit the land. Now who is David talking about? If you go back to Friday's video break you'll see that it was those who fear the Lord. Those who choose the path to walk in God's ways. And so what does prosperity look like? Well that is a loaded question because we could get so entangled to what prosperity looks like in the world that we're confused that when we're walking God's way, it may not look like the prosperity of the world. But here's the one, one of the most prosperous, pros, prosperous scenes I've ever seen in my life is when I walked into a hospital room of someone who was, who was passing away, who was, and <clears throat> they were filled with just the just the humbleness of being able to go see the Lord, that all they wanted us to do was sing, you know, sing him into heaven. Now, here is one of the most unprosperous scenes I've ever seen is when I walked into a hospital room and the person died in agony because they were unwilling to leave this world in a forgiven state. They were holding grudges, they were mad, they didn't want people seeing them. You know, they didn't want people attending their funeral because they were so angry at what life had brought them. And so prosperity looks different. When we're walking with the Lord, we're walking in his love and goodness. We talked about that all last week, just his love and faithfulness. And because the world might seem a little unfaithful to us at times, I know it does me, but God's ways are always faithful. And to me, that's prosperous. When we can walk in the faithfulness of what God has for us, despite we're not trying to climb, we're not trying to, we're not striving anymore, but we are in this, in this, in, we're living in who God is, despite our circumstances. To me, that's prosperous. When we're living in a place of a total unrest, and yet we could sing and praise the God. To me, that's prosperous. We could, you know, God says he will provide us our daily bread. We could be in need financially and yet still be thankful and singing the praises of God. We could be in physical because we often determine wealth physically, spiritually, emotionally, all tied into, you know, pros being prosperous. But God has given us so much more than those things. He's given us himself. And so prosperity looks like living in who he is. Having our eyes and attention seeking after who he is. Despite everything else around us, we've found this stillness. We found this Psalm 46, 10 to be true in our life. Be still and know. You know, it's like almost time stands still. That to me is prosperous when we can find that place with God that we that we know who he is and we rest in, in him. Oh, my friend, have a blessed day just knowing 